Hello, it's Pierre from Geo Designs. In this video, I'm going to show you the easiest way to create a sitemap in Figma. So we're going to use a, not a regular Figma file, but a FigGem file, which you can easily create uh, by clicking on the plus uh, and uh, then uh, clicking on new FigGem file. Now, the reason why we're doing this is because uh, creating the basic uh, sitemap elements uh, and the connections is going to be way easier. So we're going to start by creating uh, a rectangle, which uh, we're going to locate right here. And uh, this one is going to be the home page. Uh, you can easily resize uh, the text uh, directly from here. You can even make it bold so that uh, it uh, looks good overall <clears throat> and very clear. And then in order to create uh, a new element a new block within the sitemap simply click on uh, this element right here and you can select uh, the shape so based on uh, the type of page that you want to create uh, uh, you can simply select it from there and then you can create an inner page change the color which uh, you can use uh, one of these default colors or simply use uh, the color wheel in order to create uh, any custom uh, color variation that uh, you prefer. And then essentially you can go on uh, like this uh, for all of uh, the other pages. As you can see, it's a very easy process uh, and uh, you can easily create uh, multiple pages in a, a matter of uh, uh, seconds really. So I'm going to create uh, a smaller version of uh, this page uh, just to give you uh, an, an idea of uh, how you can create also different uh, visual hierarchies uh, so you can resize uh, the text uh, very easily and you can just change the the colors so that you can create uh, uh, different variations of uh, this uh, sitemap uh, uh, visual hierarchy in a matter of seconds really so one more thing that I want to, to leave you with uh, is uh, initially you can create everything from scratch, but a great uh, idea is also to consider uh, going through the community section, which uh, is going to allow you, if we go over here, I'm going to click on community profile um, and uh, I'm going to click on the community and I'm simply going to search for sitemap uh, and uh, as you're going to be able to see in just a second there's uh, so many different uh, sitemap templates which uh, you can use uh, so say that for example you like this one right here you can uh, click on it uh, you can have a look at uh, this uh, file this is actually the live file and then uh, you can decide uh, to click on open in figma and uh, you're going to create a duplicate uh, of this exact file so that you're not going to have to start from scratch. Uh, and uh, you can essentially leverage it uh, as a template, all 100% uh, for free. So there's so many of these uh, templates which are really going to help you save a lot of time. But if you want to start from scratch, uh, you can easily do that. Uh, and uh, change the colors, the typography, and all the elements. You can even create links uh, uh, directly into FigGem uh, to create uh, your very own uh, sitemap. So I hope that this uh, quick video was uh, helpful. And uh, if you want to learn Figma for free, and uh, um, I'm basically sharing uh, all of my knowledge of uh, the past 10 years of experience as a designer on my YouTube channel. So I would really appreciate it if uh, you want to learn uh, if you want to have a look and I'll see you in the very next video.